as much as I would love to address each of the seniors individually, I feel like there are just too many experiences and memories that we've shared together that it would just take entirely too long. Um, but one of the things I really want to focus on is how well that we have grown as a team together over the years. We've really become a family and it's been incredible to see that change. And it's going to be incredibly hard because a lot of the people who made that change possible and really made us that family are graduating this year. And it's so frustrating and so upsetting that, you know, we don't get to say goodbye together the way that we would want. But it's really important, I think, just to remember, you know, all the important things that we've had together, all of the important times, the important shows. And you guys have really made it possible for us to be successful. You know, we really are a team, whether it's helping each other get on, telling each other about the horse that we just rode, talking about courses, cleaning each other's boots. Uh, none of it would be possible without each other. And really, the seniors, you're really our moms on the team, and you really, really look out for us. I know that we're going to miss you and be completely lost without you next year. I know I'm going to be because a lot of you helped me with my transition coming onto the team and it was such an incredible experience and that's all thanks to you guys. So thank you guys so much for everything that you have done and best of luck in your future endeavors. I'm going to miss the seniors a lot this year just because that it was cut short for them due to this unforeseen circumstance but I believe that we had a great season together with all of them and that they all persevered throughout the season and really showed what they had learned and what they had gotten throughout the semester. I'm going to miss them a lot just because of how they made our team feel. It felt like a second family to me and they were always there for everybody whether it was to get on or to set up courses for the IA regional shows that we hosted at our barn. And even for team bonding, that's probably what I'm going to miss the most about it because the seniors kind of made it feel like a fun team bonding event, especially when we had like boot cleaning parties and just listen to music. Um, I guess there's no words to describe how the seniors make me feel other than like so much love that this team has given me and that I love each and every one of them all together and just that they just made it so great for this season. And I know I'm going to miss every single one of them. And they left their mark on this team, most definitely. Um, just sad that it was cut short. But I believe that they made this team a whole and they made it what it was. So they're going to be greatly missed. I would like to just thank the seniors for being so welcoming to us freshmen and always being such amazing leaders. They, they were always there for us throughout just to be um, a shoulder to lean on. They're always there for us when we got on. They're, they really shaped the team and made it a family and I'm really gonna miss them. I just wanna say thank you to the seniors for making me feel really welcome. This was my first year on the team and no matter what I was doing, there was one of them always there to help me and guide me through anything. And um, you're all just so supportive and words just can't describe how thankful I am for each and every one of you. And I'm really sorry that your season got cut short, but you'll always mean something to us. And I hope you come to our shows next year because we will miss you. I just want to say a really big old thank you to our seniors this year um, because it was my first year on the team. And I really, without without you guys being there to guide me along my walk trot ways, um, you really made the experience, the first experience I ever had for showing um, a whole lot better. And I really owe you a big thank you. And I do, I'm not crying. I do want to say a big, I'm sorry that your season is not going to end the way that you all wanted it to. Um, each and every one of you has worked so hard to get where you are now. And it's really sad that you're going to have to kind of take it with a grain of salt and just know that you worked your heart out every single time we went up into two point, every single time that you were polishing your boots, that all counts and that matters and I think that you all need to 
kind of dwell on the little things to try and get rid of the sad picture that the season's getting cut short. I'm gonna miss you all. To all my lovely seniors, I there's not enough words in the world that I can say to you guys about how much you have made my horse show experience and anything horse related really means to me. You guys were the first ones to teach me anything horses and I think I'll never forget that. I love you guys so much and you guys really made the team aspect like like a family like we all are sisters and Jake's our brother and the coaches are our parents like we all get along so well and I think that's to you guys for making us so well bonded and everything you guys have done is still gonna be on this team like you'll come back and visit and all the little goofy things we do is because of you guys and all our little um, like stuff we do before shows will keep going and all of our traditions will be to you guys and we'll always think and think of you guys before we go into the ring and I wanted to say thank you for absolutely all the things you've done for me, just horse showing or in practice or not even at the barn for always being there and making me laugh or just checking in on me. Um, you guys are absolutely the best. I'm going to love and miss you all. I just wanted to start by saying how much I love and appreciate every single one of you seniors. You guys truly made this team one big family and it would not have been the same without you. I've been dreading this moment of having to say goodbye to you guys since last year when I realized you guys would be leaving this year because these two years that we've been on the team together, we have just bonded so much and truly became a family. And next year just isn't going to be the same without you guys. Um, but I know that all the memories that we've made will be cherished. And even though we can't make any more this season, I know our friendships will last a lifetime no matter what because we truly are a family. And I just love each and every one of you. And I can't wait to see you guys soon. And I wish you all the best of luck in your futures because I know you're all gonna do such great things whether you're on or off a horse. So thank you so much for making this team such a family and I love you guys. I'm gonna try and keep this short so I don't cry or tear up, but um, to all the seniors, Alexis, Dario, Laura, Britt, Abby, Maggie, Sam, and Nikki, you guys mean so much to me. This team would not be the team we have today if it weren't for you guys. Um, all these years that we've spent in the ring, out of the ring, workouts, practices, everything, because of you guys, it has been such an amazing experience and this family has become such a huge part of my life and I'm going to miss you all so much. Um, I know this season and this year did not end how anyone expected. It happened so sudden, but all of your hard work that went into the show and went into the ring is shown throughout the year and any ribbon or any award that we would have gotten it's not shown it's not showing how much hard work and dedication that you guys put in so know that I'm so proud of each and one of you and you guys are going to go so far in life and you will always be a part of this team now and in the future you have such you've made such a big impact on me and on everyone else and I can't thank you guys enough I love you all. I really appreciate all the seniors for all the love and all the welcome, welcoming vibes that they gave me, especially coming in as a freshman. Um, I wouldn't have loved Delva as much if it wasn't for the team and all my seniors and everybody supporting me. And as everybody knows, I'm tough on myself with even the little things. And all the seniors were there to tell me, like, stop being ridiculous and just go out there and ride. And even just trying out my boots before I get in the ring and um, just giving me a few pep talks, a few words just to calm me down and make sure I'm okay and helping, supporting us and giving me a helping hand in everything that I do with riding. And this team is seriously the biggest reason I'm at Del Val and all the seniors really have helped in me loving the school and loving the team. And you guys are going to be forever family to not only me, but everybody here. Love you guys. I've honestly been dreading this moment since the seniors left last year because I knew how difficult it would be with this group of seniors just because I've had the extra year with them. I know the situation isn't the best but I'm honestly grateful I don't have to be doing this in person because I would be a complete mess with all of you. 
Um, words can't describe how big of an impact each and every one of you has had on myself and the whole team. You guys have been the best role models and over the next few years, I hope that I can be even close to as supporting, hardworking, a leader, a friend, and a teammate each and all of you were. You have been the biggest support system and such a great inspiration to keep working and to be the best teammate possible. You've become like my, some of you've been my moms, especially Abby, you've all taken care of me when I've been at my worst and at my best. You all have been there by my side and I don't know where I would be today on the team or at school without having you guys there right next to me, supporting me through every step. Thank you. I wish I would have an end of the season with you, but good luck. I hope, I know I will see you definitely guys again because this isn't goodbye, but good luck with everything in life and I wish you all the best. The thing that's most important that you guys know for me is that you were all like family to us and that we'll really miss you and that it sucks that this is how we're saying goodbye, but like Haley said, this definitely won't be our official goodbye because I'm sure we'll see you soon. Um, I really just want to thank you guys for being great role models and helping us along the way. A lot of us didn't expect the show ring to be like it is, but with you guys, it really helped. Um, I also want to say thank you for making my days better. Like when I was walking around campus and I was having a really bad day, you guys would say hi to us. Or if you're at the barn and you saw us, you'd make sure to say hi or see how we were doing. And that was really important to me because some days were worse than others. I also want to give a shout out to Alexis because I think you did a great job stepping up as captain this semester. And you definitely made the team feel the most family it's felt for me since I've been on the team. So thank you guys. And we all love you. And I hope you guys do amazing things. I don't really know what else to say except thank you. Thank you guys for always being there and for accepting me and welcoming me. Um, when I first came here, I'd been riding my whole life, but I'd never been on a team before. And I didn't really know what to expect. But you guys, the first year were like, you welcomed me and you accepted me. And I never really felt that before. And I can't thank you for enough enough for um, welcoming me like that. And I know it sucks that we have to say goodbye this way, but um, I <laughs> uh, thank you for everything. Um, riding's always given me a home, but uh, you guys made it a family, so thank you. I'm truly thankful for each and every one of the seniors that I got to spend my time with on the team. Um, like Evelyn said, I never was a part of a team like this before. So having that like unconditional love and unconditional support that you guys offered, like going in the ring, even like if we had a bad ride, you were always there to help boost our confidence back up and like get us back to like a happy mood and like supportive mood for the rest of the team and just kind of like brush off that bad ride. Um, I definitely want to say huge thank you to Alexis because she knows that last semester I was kind of struggling a lot so she was always there to check up on me to make sure like if I needed anything like she was always like just a text away so I definitely appreciate that and appreciate her stepping up as captain this semester um we're definitely going to miss all of you um so I wish you luck with everything you do in the rest of your lives but I'm sure we'll see you again soon friends I'm going to carry with me for the rest of my life um they are all just amazing human beings and they're gonna go off and do amazing and great things in this world, I already know it. Um, they're just great people and mentors and they really showed us how to all come together and be one big happy rather than just focusing on winning. Um, I wasn't very competitive when I came. This year's seniors brought a certain kind of energy to the team. They are the absolute backbone that kept everybody going and making sure that everybody was striving to be the absolute best that they could. And that is a foundation that we will be able to use and build on in the future. So even though we have some unfinished business with our season, Everything that you are leaving and worked hard for this year is going to leave a legacy for years in the future 
for, you know, next year's team and the year after that and propel them to be successful as well. And that's something that you should be proud of. Um, I know that I am proud of every single one of you all. It's been an absolute pleasure being able to coach uh, each one of you. And I know that everything that you dream to do in the future is within reach. You all have a wonderful uh, work ethic and a lot of heart and a lot of passion for the things that you feel strongly about. And I want you to know that I am so proud of you all and watching you all grow has been just an absolute pleasure. Uh, I want you to remember that you always have a home here with us. Um, So please visit us often. Um, We're just a phone call or a text or an email away and know that we're always here for you um, today and all of the rest of the days. Uh, We'll definitely miss you all, but please know that um, we are so proud of you all and we know that you are on to big things in your future. I just want to say as a whole, you guys mean so much to me, this particular group of seniors. Um, It's my fourth year of coaching. So this means that you seniors are the ones that, you know, I started with uh, when you guys were freshmen. Um, So I especially have been dreading this moment Um, and hearing what all your teammates had to say about you um, just makes me feel so good because you guys have just grown not only on your horses, but also as, you know, friends and family with these guys. And I just, I can't thank you enough for um, all that you've put into this team. Um, I know no one has called anybody out individually, but I'm going to do um, real quick. Um, Britt, you are just so bougie and I love you so much. And I'm going to miss your presidential walking and trotting. Um, Sam, you are always a smiling face, and um, you're so coachable and a great cheerleader. Abby, you're just so polished when you come to practice and in the show ring and your lighthearted spirit. Um, I love how you smile at me when I, you know, coach you, and then you turn around and you show that frustration. I'll say, but wait, one more thing, and then you smile again. Um, Nikki, you're so dedicated, and you've worked through some really tough practices, and, and it's paid off, and LP, your quirkiness is hilarious, um, as everyone would agree. And I think we share a little randomness that way. You never know what we're gonna say. Um, Maggie, what I'll remember about you is that you were a sophomore before I realized your name was Mary. Love that. Um, And you're just such a hard worker. Um, Daria, you're like the sunshine. I love your laughter. Um, I love how you love a challenge. I love how people always send you to tell me bad news, like the buses aren't here. Um, It was great. (laughs) And Alexis, there's so much to be said, like your teammates have said. Um, You've risen to every occasion. I don't know how you balance everything in your life so perfectly. And um, I'm just so proud of you. You know, I look at you and you're just composed in every situation and it's just amazing. And you all are gonna be so successful. And I'm going to miss you so much, but I will see you when I call on you to come school at our horse shows. And I hope to see you in our alumni classes really soon. So miss you guys. Love you. This definitely isn't how we wanted the season to end. Um, We wanted to be zone three champions again, which I guess we're reigning zone three champions. So that's good, right? Um, But I'm so, so glad that our seniors are being recognized Um, I'm so proud of them. Our seniors are the heart of this team, Um, as next year's seniors will be, and the year after that, those seniors will be, and the years before those seniors were. Um, Everybody has risen to the occasion, um, and I'm really, really proud. I want to make sure that you take with you some life lessons from DVUET. So the first one I wanna make sure you take with you is sometimes life doesn't give you the best draw, the blue ribbon, the seven points, but you can rely on your people and be proud of yourself. And the second one is in life, you're either a point rider or a point blocker, but you're always a player, so do your best. The third thing is to wear your seatbelts. Fourth, no phones at dinner. And fifth, hugs always. We love you so much. We're so proud of you. 
um, once an Aggie, always an Aggie. We can't wait to see you back on campus next year.